welcome back. Meghan Markle has used some clever wardrobe tricks to flatter her body during her Royal African tour. Yeah, to tell us about these must-have tips, we caught up with eco-stylist Faye Delante. Megan has just been on her tour of Africa looking fantastic, but she's actually been employing some really clever wardrobe tricks. So I wanted to share those with you guys today and also show you how you can save a ton of money by finding very similar looks from an op shop. The wrap dress is a universal piece of fashion gold. It's such a flattering item to add into your wardrobe and it's definitely a style that Megan gravitates towards. The beauty of this dress is that it's got a beautiful V shape which is highlighting the decolletage and then it's cinching in at the waist which is so flattering on the female form. And then it's, you know, just kind of skimming the body. It's not too tight. This dress I found here at the salvos for 12 bucks Megan loves the shirt dress she rocks that a lot on her tours it's comfortable it's easy to slip on you can move around but you still look put together so I couldn't find the one piece but what I did was I found a skirt and a shirt and team them together so you can get that same kind of vibe and then what I did I just cinched it in in the middle I found a really cute sort of Ralph Lauren polo inspired belt which I think is very princess worthy and we've just added that through the middle and just a simple nude shoe and she's ready to rock and roll. When Meghan met the Archbishop in Cape Town, she wore something so similar to this dress. Hers was close to 400 pounds. I found this piece here at the Salvos for 10 bucks. Now, what's fantastic about this is again, it's that universally flattering shape. So the V-neck is very slimming, and of course, the cinched in waist as well is really kind of drawing Julia in and highlighting her feminine curves. But the beautiful thing about this dress too is it's not tight. It's just skimming the body, it's flowing, and same as the cap sleeve. It's a little bit, you know, you're not showing too much shoulder, it's flattering on the arm, and again, it's not tight. You don't want a tight cap sleeve. This is just skimming, and it just looks really elegant and put together, but she can function, she can hold the baby, she can do what she needs to do. And then I just teamed it with, because she was in Africa, I found this beautiful tribal print clutch for that pop of colour and, you know, as a nod and to honour the country that she was in. And then everything else, just nice and simple. Megan loves khaki and I think that's another genius point to talk about with her wardrobe. She wears a lot of neutrals. Now neutrals are great because they're a wonderful blank canvas and then from there you can really add a little bit of personality and quirk depending on the event. So a simple khaki shirt dress style again with a very flattering cap sleeve. So this is just sitting on the edge of the shoulder but it's not showing too much skin. And then again that lovely collar. So to add some personality, the Royals do love a brooch, so I've added in a vintage orchid brooch and then cinched in the waist with a belt in the same colour family, but it's a slightly darker shade, so it adds some more dimension. And then just a really simple, strappy nude shoe. And this whole outfit is $40. These tips and tricks are really universal and they work on so many different body shapes. You know, it really just flatters that natural, feminine, curvy form. So I think it's going to look really great on a lot of body shapes. Baby, there's nothing holding me back. Well, I will be integrating all of those tips into my wardrobe <laughs> this spring. You know what? You probably should. Mm -hmm. They're very good tips. Coming up on